Hey everyone, it's Leah from Thrifted Nest, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how I painted this French Provincial Dresser white from start to finish. This is a simple tutorial for people who are maybe just getting started in refinishing furniture, or for anyone looking to get a smooth white finish. All of the products used will be in the description below and everything should be able to be purchased at your local hardware store or on Amazon. To get started, I removed all hardware and put it in a labeled bag. Then using 180 grit sandpaper, I sanded the entire piece down. You don't need to sand all the way down to bare wood, just scuff it up enough to give the paint something to grip to. My favorite product for cleaning furniture is Crud Cutter TSP Substitute in the spray bottle. It removes the dirt and oil really well and it doesn't need to be rinsed off afterwards. If you don't have this, a simple vinegar water solution works really well too. After cleaning, I wipe the entire dresser down with a tack cloth to remove any lingering dust that will show through the finish. I always prime my furniture when I'm painting white to stop any bleed through and to give my paint a good base. Here I'm using Bin 123 Primer. It's inexpensive and it works really well. Try to end each stroke in the same direction, but don't stress out about brush strokes, they will be covered by the paint. Just focus on getting a thin, even coat. To get a smooth finish after every coat, I do a very light sanding with 220 grit sandpaper. Make sure to remember to wipe down with a tack cloth right before every coat so you don't end up with lint in your paint. For the paint, I chose Benjamin Moore in Simply White. It's a latex paint and it levels extremely well so you get a smooth finish. Once you move on to a new area, resist the urge to go back and smooth out brush strokes. It will look like you need to, but the paint levels so well, if you leave it be, it will smooth out for you. Using an angled brush, paint thin, light coats.
Since this paint levels so well, you also have to wait 16 hours in between coats. And the downside to painting white is it can take three to four coats to get the color just right. But this paint has a built-in top coat, so there's no need for a sealer. If the piece is gonna get really heavy use and you wanna use a top coat, remember to use a water-based sealer like polycrylic so your paint doesn't yellow. Now it's time to move on to your hardware. I soaked my hardware in a mixture of crud cutter and then dried it off with a towel. I sprayed one coat of primer and then three coats of black spray paint. After that, I screwed the hardware back on the dresser. And then you are done. Here's the finished dresser. I hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. If you liked it, make sure you subscribe below. I'll be posting new videos every week. Feel free to send me all of your furniture before and afters. I'd love to see them. See you next time.